Hello guys, how are you? Today I want us to learn about how to restore our iPhone from recovery. So you plug in your phone whilst holding the home button if you have the ones with the home button. Without the home button one, you can use with the iPhone X, XR and then the XS Max upward. You can use up volume down and then you pull the side button. And then until you see the sign up, and then if you connect it to your PC, it will show on your PC like if you want to restore it or you want to update it. So we need to restore and update. So we will restore and update. We start the process. And then as the process is going on, you will just follow the prompts on the screen and then you do it one by one. So we just wait for the software, the framework to download from Apple server and then we will just it's about 4 gb so we will wait for it to finish download whilst we wait this is my new video on restoring the iphone from dfu mode to reset it to to restart maybe you forgot your password maybe you locked your phone you know something and then you need to recover it but remember you will lose your data so we need to be making your backup so now it's downloading we will wait for you to finish downloading and as you can see it's uh, overwriting the software verifying it to the phone so it will copy from the server and then it will put it on the phone so we will wait for it i want you guys to also stick to this channel and then i want you to subscribe like and then follow you can share the video also to someone who needs it and then you can come back always for more you can also suggest if there is something you would like me to make a video about you can also suggest it to me and then i will do just that it's been long but now i think uh, we are back on the kintech hub and there will be more videos for you and your fan and my fans so we will wait for you to finish its restoring you know normally apple gives this chance if your phone is um, a higher version which is uh, the iphone x xr to the 14 pro or the pro max you still can do this on it it doesn't matter what has happened to the phone so now it's restoring we we'll wait for it to restart you see your iphone has been restored to factory settings so everything is new it's just like a new iphone so we will from there we will just set it up as a new iphone and then we will we'll move forward from there when we boot to the home screen so if the phone is actually yours it will prompt you to log in your apple id but if it is not for you voila your phone will be locked to activation lock and you can't open it so you have to make sure you remember your details and everything you see it's locked to honest details so i will log in you choose your country and then the language and everything from there you just continue with your wi-fi setup so whilst we wait i think many of us we will need a good wi-fi or if you have a sim card with data on your phone you can still use it you don't need to be in a wi-fi you can use your data so it's recovery restoring the iCloud details from the server to your phone and then you enter your Apple ID and then you from there you will set up a few security with this I am setting up my fingerprint and password so I want you to come back every time for this channel on this channel and there will be more for you to learn from more tech more things to come from this channel so basically i'll be uploading another video very soon so i want you to come back to the channel to check so you just enter your password the preferred one and then here we like to set it up as a new iphone so we don't want to transfer anything from here. this uh, this phone has been dead for about a month and then I didn't have the time to do it so when I had the time I so you set your wallet later Apple Pay if you have a card you set, you set Siri later also and then voila here we are on the screen thank you for 
watching thank you come back again you can like you share you subscribe on this channel for more tech from thinking tech hub so that's your video there and then you can apply it to any other device with app ipads also it works the same way just follow the same procedure let's follow the steps and then you will be fine thank you guys see ya